France's latest outrageous threats to punish the UK over the hotly disputed Brexit fishing deal have been destroyed by a leading Frexiteer, who has told Emmanuel Macron to blame the European Union for the mess they find themselves in. France has been left furious after the UK government last month said it had approved just 12 of the 47 applications it had received from French small boats. That rage only intensified when it was later announced by the Jersey government that of 170 license applications it had received from French boats, 75 had been rejected. Earlier this week, French European Affairs Minister Clement Bone warned EU member states are preparing to announce measures to apply pressure on the UK to abide by the terms of the Brexit deal. He stopped short of detailing what those measures might be, but noted in an interview with a French radio station that Britain depends on energy supplies it receives from Europe. French fishing industry representatives have also threatened to block the port of Calais and stop exports to the UK in the run-up to Christmas. But the latest threats from France over fishing access rights have been torn apart by a leading Frexiteer, who has told French President Emmanuel Macron and his right-hand man Mr. Bone they only have themselves and the EU to blame. Generation Frexit President Charles Henry Galois told Express.co.uk, the threats from Clement Bone are quite ridiculous, above all when he says Brexit deal should be implemented fully, basically, the UK is implementing it. It was a bad deal signed by the EU but Macron cannot acknowledge that as an Euro fanatic. The deal included that the boats allowed to fish until 2026 were the ones that were fishing between 2016 and 2020. Many small French boats have no recording systems so they cannot prove it. The deal was badly negotiated, and he should blame the EU for that. Queen Margaret II to bring Karen Blixen's image creating worlds to life in Netflix film.